Bill cut out before I could actually show you the script going. Um, I didn't even realize it had, but anyway, uh, after you get all that in there, you should be able to click run, and then enter in your IP address you'd like to check. 2.61.1.1234 and yeah sure I'll enter it because it's not currently reserved and is available for use uh, Nick Stevermer is my name so that's who this IP address will be for uh, my MAC address is that and my computer name is Nick Comp 2 and you can see it is created if you go back to your DHCP server and refresh your result or your your list or whatever you'll see that I now have my two new reservations I made with the script and if I open that or sorry right click properties you'll see it's populated and here for whatever reason they just you enter it with a hyphen and the GUI drops the hyphen so the I'm not sure why they don't uh, do it consistently throughout the product, but they do not. And then down here on the filter, you'll see that they do keep the hyphen. So I'm not sure why. Maybe somebody knows, but I don't. Um, and actually, I guess you'll notice that my filter is not working. So I must have made a typo in there. Filter add DHCP filter v4 list Mac address hello hmm. I can't see it right now but for whatever reason it's not working I can show you the the previous one I wrote though um, go to Documents. And if I do this one, 92.61.1.125. There we go, and I'll add Nick Stevermer. Has a lot of computers. Uh, Nick. And it's entered. You'll see the filters created. And there might, there must be some. I must have typoed something in there for the other one. Cause oh no, I just didn't refresh. That would be why. Okay. Um, there you go. Thanks for watching.